Hello and welcome to Hardware Set Info. In this tutorial, I will show you how to restore your phone backup from Google on Samsung S25 Ultra. Let's begin. Now, if you're wondering how I get to the screen, um, you have to perform a factory reset on your phone and during the initial setting, setting things up, for example, language, Wi-Fi and other stuff, you will be able to choose to restore your backup from Google Cloud. We don't want to connect to our network, not yet, and we have to agree to end user license agreement. We don't want to make an easy setup with another device, so we'll set up manually. And we need to have a Wi-Fi network. So I will choose this one. And I will quickly input the password. And after you connect to your one to your Wi-Fi network, it will be it will take a while, but for me it was pretty quick. We could transfer our SIM right here, but we can also do that later in settings. There's no need to do that now. And now here comes the Google part. So the phone needs a few few minutes to think. And now we can choose to copy apps and data. We want to click next. We simply say that we can't use other device. And now we have to log in into our Google account in which we have the backup saved on. So I will click quickly log in and after we are logged in we will be asked uh, who will use this device if you want to give device to your kid you should check this option and it will take you to setting up the family link but we are grown up men and we will be using this device. We simply click next. We have to agree to Google Terms of Service. And as you can see, we have a bunch of different backups to choose from. I'm going to choose this one that I made half an hour ago. And here we can choose which apps we can we want to restore. We can turn some off, turn some on. I might leave the clock out because I really don't like the alarms I said there. And then simply click restore. And in the background we can still set up our phone while Google gives us our data back. We can click we can click accept and we can automatically check to turn on backup when the Google when the phone sorry when the phone is charging for example. We can log into Samsung account now or we can do it later in settings. There's no need to do that now. Or you cannot skip this part apparently because the Gem Gemini is built in even if you say no thanks. Oh, see, if you if you set uh, if you say that you don't remember your password, you can set it up later in settings. They really want us to 
get us this Samsung account. After we agree to terms and conditions, and bunch of other things. We are all set up. And our data from the Google backup is now here on our phone. If you found this tutorial helpful, please consider liking and subscribing. Thanks for watching.